Welcome, Mario Nugget Pips. So we have a new series, and this is called Checkpoint One on One on One. So in this series, we're going to tackle from the scratch configuration of Checkpoint Firewall to more advanced level. So let's start. As you can see in our diagram, we have uh, a GNS3 diagram, uh, two ISP. Uh, which is the I call it 5555 and 777 so we will be using the latest version of checkpoint which is the R80.30 so let's start so as you can see I already con uh, uh, created the VM for the for our checkpoint it has an 8 gig memory and 4 processor so let's start so so as you can see here we will be doing more on the um, wizard type of initial configuration of checkpoint so just choose uh, of course the first one install Gaia on the system so what will another thing is what will you see here in this video video is the same thing that you will gonna be you will you will gonna do on the actual unit itself when you are doing um reformatting or installation of firmware uh, of the checkpoint firewall So here we go. Uh, the the first question will be: Do you wish to proceed with the installation? Of course, click hit enter. Click OK. Then hit just hit enter. Okay. By the default, um, it says here eight twenty twenty. These values actually depends on the hard disk of the of the uh, of the system that was detected by by the firmware. Okay, so for me, I just want to modify this one with the lugs of um, 30 GB. So, this thing works. Okay, 30, no, 35. Okay, so hit enter. For the password, um, of course, my favorite password. So it's always uh best thing to use uh alphanumeric password, okay? So it says here that we will choose uh the management port for this uh to handle or to manage our checkpoint firewall later, okay? So normally it's the ETH zero. So we have actually a uh, based on diagram we have here the ip address which is the 172.16.20.254 all right 172.16.20.254 okay so you can actually erase that default gateway okay are you sure want to continue yes so after that uh, mini wizard uh it it will eventually install the Gaia itself or the firmware itself. So we we'll just need to wait until the installation of the operating system R80.30 is done. Okay.
So we are done with the installation of the firmware or the installation of the OS which is the R80.30. So it says here we after the reboot we will access the GUI which is the 172.16.20.254. So we will now hit the reboot but first thing um, before you hit the reboot um, you will in the actual machine you will uh, disconnect the flash drive that uh, you use upon the upon formatting the machine okay so in our case um, since it is a VM you don't need to do that okay so we just need to hit enter for this So now we are actually um, able to access the machine. So as you can see, there's a prompt. In order to configure your system, please access the web UI and finish the first time wizard. So um, the first thing to do is to check if we are we are we are, we are uh, able to access or reach the management IP address of the firewall 172.16.20.254 yeah so let's start HTTPS 172.16.20.254 yeah so for now, I will um, end this video. Um, we, the next, the next video will be uh, will be the first time configuration of the wizard. Okay, so hopefully uh, you you learn from this video, and I hope to see you also on the next video. Thank you for your support and for your time to view.